to be talking to you for just a minute about print head alignment and color calibration. Both are important because they affect the way color is printed. Print head alignment is absolutely mandatory for things like smooth transitions and for sharpness on your graphics and text. Under most circumstances, the printer will automatically initiate a print head alignment when you do one of two things. When you either access the print heads, take one out physically, or if it is that you replace a print head, it's important to remember that the higher quality of media that you have in the printer when you do a print head alignment will assure an even greater quality of the alignment. Even though the printer is going to do it automatically under most circumstances, you also have the opportunity to evoke the process yourself by simply going to the main menu, you toggle to the image quality maintenance menu and press OK and then scroll down one to the align print heads option and say OK. So, after starting the process of a print head alignment, it prints and scans a page that to our human eyes looks like mm, digital noise, but in reality it's a series of lines with precise placement that the printer's been able to analyze and put your print heads into alignment. Color calibration is a process that is in position to allow, allow for repeatable, consistent, and accurate color coming out of your printer. There are certain times that it is that you need to evoke a color calibration. If it is that you're loading a new type of media that hasn't been calibrated with the current set of print heads, that's a good time to calibrate. If it is that you are have any components of your ink system, meaning primarily your print heads replaced, that's a good time to calibrate. Also, if there's a period of time or an amount of printing that's gone on, it's the right time to calibrate. If ever there's any question about the current status of your calibration, you can simply go to the front control panel and press the information button. It's going to show you information about your printer, including down here, the status of your color calibration. In this case, it's recommended that we perform a color calibration. So we're going to do this simply by going, accessing the main menu. We're going to toggle and make sure we're, we're at the image quality maintenance menu. We're going to press OK and we're going to use the rocker switch up, go to color calibration, say OK again, and the process begins. So what's just happened is that the printer has produced this series of honeycomb shaped color patches. What will happen is once the printer has produced the series of patches, it will wait about a minute and a half for it to complete a dry time that will allow for the colors to stabilize. At that point in time, this small series of color patches will be pulled back into the printer. The printer will utilize its internal spectrophotometer and it will measure color. Based on what it's seeing, in contrast to what it was expecting to see, it will generate some calculations and apply the adjustments and produce beautiful, consistent, and accurate color time after time.